In this video, we are going to learn how to send birthday greetings automatically using Google Sheets and App Script. As an example, I have taken sending email for birthday greeting, but it can be used for any activity that occurs yearly on particular date. So let's solve this problem. Let's get started. There are two things we need to implement one is the structure of our data and the second is writing google app script so here i have structure of data which includes name of a person then uh, birth date which is a date uh, on which the activity occurs every year and the email address so if anything happens anything related to this person the email or notification should be sent on this email address in the last column it will be populated by our app script once the script is executed so basically it's going to write their timestamp so that we can know that for which entries the emails have been sent now let us see the app script so on the top you can see a menu where this birthday is our own menu that we have created so shortly we'll see that how we we create it to open the app script you need to click on this extensions and click on this app script so it's going to open this kind of window after it gets open by default it will be untitled so you need to save that as a project and when we run it we need to give permission so i'll show you that in the demo part now let us understand the script that we need to write so we write one function called on open where this is a callback function which, which will be executed whenever we open our script so basically it is populating that menu which is coming here uh, this code is for populating that menu now let us see the central part of this video which is sending an email so let's understand our send email function so before i show you these steps and explain you the steps let's understand the logic so logic is pretty straightforward so our script will find out today's date by creating a date object and then in today's date it will extract the day and the month and once it will extract the day and month and then from this list that we have specified it is going to match each and every record and for whichever record the day and month both are matching for that record it is going to extract the name and email and it will send birthday greeting on that email address and once that email is sent here it's going to write the log message so let us see the logic and let's understand the code line 13 and 14 are related to opening our google sheet and because our data is starting from row number two we take this variable and then in that range we getting the data range of our whole sheet which contains our data so starting from the row number two till the last row we get all the data and we are looking for data of four columns because you can see here our data which with which we are going to deal is in a b c d four columns so we write that so we write that part then we fetch values for each row in this range so we are getting that then we take these three variables name birth date and email address and we create date object for today's date and then we have for loop which is going to search for all this data that we have populated in this data so this for loop is going to search in this data range and row by row we are searching for that so from Initially, we store this name, birth date, and email address in these three variables from each row, and then we do comparison. So let us see that part. The central part is here that if today's get date is matching with birth date that is specified in the Google Sheet, and month is also matching. So in that case, we generate body for our email that is dear friend and then you can see here we are writing the name of the person so it becomes customized for that particular user instead of a common birthday greeting message 
this is your dear friend name wish you very happy birthday so here whatever you want to write you can write it and the subject is birthday greeting and after that we check that if email address is not null then we send email using this mail api of google so we specify the email address and we specify subject and body and once the email has been sent we log it into the fourth column using this where we said that birthday greeting sent at this particular date and once we have processed the first row we are going to increment it by one so that it is going to do the same steps for the next row in this it's going to process all the rows that we have specified in our this google sheet and it's going to process it now just for demonstration i have set birth date for two people as having today's day number that is 28 january and i'll show you that how we can use it so let us run this application click on this our own menu click on this send greetings so it is asking for authorization we need to give permission to our script we select our account and we authorize our application now because this application we have created there is no problem in giving access to our own app so we can rely on that we click on advance and we click on this link it is asking us for permission we can say allow so now our script will run okay so that is just it was asking with for the permission now we need to run it again yes so you can see that here it has sent birthday greeting to this to this user because his birthday is falling on this date just for demonstration i have set a birthday for two people on 28th of jan so irrespective of the year like one has birthday in year 1995 whereas other has in 1999 to both these people the greeting was sent and we can verify that here you can see here to apply it3 the email has been sent in same way to this user also email has been sent so in this way you can easily create your own app script which can do this kind of activities repeatedly on every year now as an exercise what you can do here we need to click this button to send email even you want to automate that then it is possible you need to create a trigger for your app script and the trigger will be executed daily and on some particular time so that you can configure it earlier we have created a video on uh, executing some code based on triggers you can find that video i will paste the link in the description this kind of script can automate our task and it can save our time you can use it not only for sending birthday greetings but you can use it to uh, send notification to the self for example uh, paying insurance premium which is falling on some particular date we can uh, write that information into our sheet we can also send notification to self for say paying uh, some fees which happen regularly in particular quarter or on particular date we can customize it so thanks for watching and happy learning